How to deploy a web server Apache HTTPD on Red Hat-like system with Ansible? I'm going to show you a live demo with some simple Ansible code. I'm Luca Burton and welcome in today's episode of Ansible Pilot. Today we are talking about how to deploy a web server specifically Apache HTTPD on Red Hat-like Linux system. The full process requires four steps that you could automate with different Ansible modules. Firstly, you need to install the HTTPD package and dependency using the ansible.builtin.yam Ansible module. You can use DNF or modern system as well. Secondly, you need to create the custom index.html with Ansible built-in copy. Oh, there is a typo, never mind. <laughs> you could upgrade this step using template module. Thirdly, you need to start the HTTPD service and enable on boot and all the dependent using the ansible.builtin.service Ansible module. And fourthly, you need to open the relevant firewall service related ports using the ansible.posix.firewallD Ansible module. Yeah, it's not a mistake, uh, the last is a POSIX because it interacts with all the POSIX compliant system. Are you ready to have fun? Let's move to a quick live demo about how to deploy a web server Apache HTTPD on Red Hat-like system with Ansible Playbook. If you prefer NGINX, maybe one of next video. Welcome to my editor. Let's have fun. Free dash for a YAML document and then let's start our play with a setup na web server name that is going to be executed on host all of my inventory and of course I need become set to true because I need privilege escalation with root power to install packages and whatever. Task list, remember, four different stuff. First of all, let's install HTTPD. So I'm going to use ansible.builtin.yam. The name of the package is HTTPD for Apache. Yeah, no, that is use this stuff. Debian is different. And state latest, so we can also update the package if already present. Mm, what else? Uh, custom index.html. Uh, I'm going to use ansible.builtin.module copy because I want a simple text inside. Destination is uh, var www.html index.html. This is default placeholder for Apache. I'm going to specify some content, just let me use the pipe and some simple text like a custom web page. You can type uh, multi-line uh, HTML page here, or may maybe better use a template module for more complex stuff. Uh, let me enable the service, so HTTPD service enabled. I'm going to use ansible.builtin.service. Here we go, three parameter. First, the name of the service, HTTPD enabled true because we want to run on boot and the state will be started because uh, we want to run it now. Okay, now let's take care of the firewall. So name, is task need to have a name. So open firewall, ansible.posix.firewallD, here we go. Uh, service will be 
this service name, uh, in my case, HTTP, be mindful without the end of the, yeah, fantastic. Uh, state will be enabled because we want to enable this uh, rule. Uh, immediate, true, because we want the rule to run it now. And permanent, which means that uh, also on the next boot up, we want this rule to be enabled. So here we go, we verify that HTTPD is the installed at the latest version. We customize a little bit the index.html, so not the standard one of the distribution. We can use our brand or maybe better replace with a template in the future. But this is enough for this small demo. When what else? Run the service, set up to start up on boot with a service module and open up the firewall. Yeah, it's important. So we take care of all the important things and it runs in Ansible in seconds. It's so it's fantastic. Let's move it on on the terminal to see the fun. Welcome to my terminal. First of all, let me connect to my demo machine via SSH. DevOps is the username at demo.example.com. Here we go. I'm connecting with a normal user, so I need to switch to root with sudo su. Let me cut the etc os release, so it's a standard Red Hat Enterprise Linux, as you see. Let me DNF list install it to verify HTTP D status. And uh, is not installed. Uh, double check with RPM dash QE pipe grab HTTPD. No package list. So really HTTPD is not installed. Let me cut the placeholder file, like the custom a index html under var www html index no such file or directory and in general slash var slash www doesn't exist so this is a clean machine just fresh after install and i'm going to run ansible playbook on it so we can see the result after all Ansible dash playbook to execute the code dash e is my inventory and uh, virtual machine demo and let's run it the service HTTPD for Red Hat like system. In uh, a couple of seconds is taking care of uh, setting up, downloading, installing the HTTPD. The time depends on uh, the network performance and machine. But as you can see, in a modern environment, it ran in seconds. So it installed, downloaded, customized the index, set it up, uh, the uh, service, and the firewall. What happens if I run again the code? I'm expecting this time OK status, so which means only check it out the status of the service. This property is called hidden potency. So let me connect again to my demo machine ssh devops is the username demoexample.com sudo su and let me list the installed package httpd this time i'm expecting some line and here we go httpd 2.4 37 is correctly installed from upstream repository rpm dash qe pipe uh, grab httpd give a similar result uh, as you can see this is enterprise linux 8.5 so cool um, let me cut uh, the custom index uh, html and what a <laughs> surprise is exactly the result that we saw in our playbook so good job ansible as you can see, in uh, seconds, I'm able to spin up a new web server for my uh, laboratory. So this is great, and the machine is always in the uh, current state. So I can uh, run it on one machine, 1,000 machine, 1 million machine, and everybody will be in the uh, state in the consistent state. 
but probably you are used to see web pages in a different way so let me open up the browser to verify also the firewall and everything else I just type demoexample.com and I'm able to see my custom web page result so it seems that Apache is working on the target machine the firewall is configured and the service is running so great success thank you Ansible now you know how to deploy a web server Apache HTTPD on Red Hat like system with Ansible as you see this running seconds and it's incredible how this technology is working so thank you for watching if you have enjoyed this video give me some thumbs up write me a comment and keep me in contact with me and see us on the next IT adventure of Ansible Pilot and have a great day yay this video is part of our Ansible automation program sign up today on www.ansiblepilot.com for uninterrupted exclusive video and so much fun